There's a third person running in Saturday's Democratic primary. Dr. Willie Wilson is on the ballot and he was stumping for votes in the upstate tonight. WIFF News Force John Lyon was listening at a town hall meeting in Greenville. Okay. Thank you. Now, I need your volunteer too, all right? <laughs> Willie Wilson signs a book for someone he hopes will vote for him in Saturday's Democratic primary. And we were brought up in a way to make sure that we uh, look after and try to care for other people once we able to make it in, in life. You might be wondering, who is Willie Wilson? Well, he's a Chicago businessman who started out making 20 cents an hour as a middle school dropout. Now he runs a medical supply company that makes $60 million a year in sales. I'm kind of, I'm an example of the American dream, you know. Young people can look up and see that you can make it. His next goal is the presidency, bringing his modest campaign to the Phyllis Wheatley Center in Greenville, to people, he says, who are just like him. I'm not happy if somebody else out here is struggling, so that's why I dedicate my life to this cause. He drew about 150 to the event and is running against Hillary Clinton and Bernie Sanders, who drew over 5,000 to his last stop in Greenville. To say that Wilson is an underdog is a huge understatement. He even says the party is against him. Been totally unfair. Um, they kept me off the uh, debate. You know, uh, they said they haven't they have sanctioned me. So therefore, they say I'm not a Democratic candidate. As a Christian, Wilson is running on a faith-based platform. He wants to forgive all student loan and make college free. He also wants to focus on America's problems first. In the politics arena, you could have far more people, and that's why I'm here. Wilson's only on the ballot in 11 states, including South Carolina, and he says it's going to be an uphill battle but he hopes to surprise the party establishment on Saturday night. John Lyon, WIFF News 4, Greenville.